Albert Fish was an American serial killer, child rapist, and cannibal who terrorized New York City during the early 20th century. He was born on May 19, 1870, in Washington, D.C., and was the youngest of three children. Fish's family had a history of mental illness, and his mother suffered from hallucinations. His father died when he was just five years old, leaving him in the care of his mother. Fish began to experience sexual fantasies at a young age, and by the time he was a teenager, he was already engaging in self-harm and sadomasochistic practices. He later claimed that he enjoyed inserting needles into his genitals and that he derived sexual pleasure from pain. Fish's criminal activities began in the 1890s, where he began to work as a male prostitute in New York City. He would often target young boys and was arrested multiple times for soliciting sex. However, Fish's criminal record didn't stop him from getting married and starting a family. He had six children and was a devoted father to them. Despite his seemingly normal family life, Fish's violent tendencies continued. He began to target young children and would lure them away from their homes or playgrounds. Fish would torture and murder his victims and then consume their flesh. One of Fish's most infamous crimes occurred in 1928 when he kidnapped and murdered a 10-year-old girl named Grace Budd. Fish had initially responded to an advertisement seeking employment that was placed by Grace's family. He posed as a farmer and took Grace to his home in Westchester County. There, he tied her up, strangled her to death, and then dismembered her body. He later sent a letter to Grace's family describing in graphic detail how he had killed and eaten her. Fish was apprehended on December 13, 1934, and put on trial for the kidnapping and murder of Grace Budd. During his trial, Fish claimed that he had been commanded by God to kill and that he had acted out of love for his victims. He was found guilty of the murder of Grace Budd and was sentenced to death by electrocution. Fish showed no remorse for his crimes. On January 16, 1936, Albert Fish was executed at Sing Sing Correctional Facility in New York. He was 65 years old. Allegedly, his last words were, I don't even know why I'm here. After the execution, Fish's lawyer, James Dempsey, told the press he was in possession of Fish's final statement, a handful of handwritten notes that Fish had written hours before his death. When pressed for details about the documents, Dempsey told reporters, I will never show it to anyone. It was the most filthy string of obscenities that I have ever read. Albert Fish was a deeply disturbed individual who committed heinous crimes against young children. His sexual fantasies and sadistic tendencies led him to engage in acts of torture, murder, and cannibalism. Although he was eventually caught and executed, his crimes continue to haunt those who remember them. Hey everybody, it's Winter Freshest. I just wanted to say thank you for watching my video. Hope you enjoyed it. If you like what you saw and you want to see more, consider subscribing to my channel and also hit the bell so you're notified whenever I drop a new video. As always, much love and thanks again.